All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Blue Lock episode twelve, a uh, the final se final episode in the first core, I believe. Uh, I, d I don't exactly know when core two is. I'm not sure if a date's already been revealed for that, but yeah, last episode mid season finale. Okay. Um, in the last episode, uh, apologies for not being on my channel reacting to it. Uh, I was busy that weekend, but I did watch it, and damn, it was a good ass episode. Uh, Isagi puffed off. Uh, made that goal his bitch and damn that was just a, it was a really good start to the episode uh we found out now in the second part that um everybody in building five is actually everyone there are not like four of the buildings it's just them um they are the best of the best whether there's still 300 people in there i'm not sure i think there is um but well there's not anymore anyway we saw a lot of them go home with their tails between their legs crying uh, and Isagi was like, yeah, I love this. Oh, I want to send more people home. <laughs> I'm a masochist. But um, yeah, very cool. Now we're on to like a singles event, which it sucks. Uh, it, I mean, we know what Blue, Blue Lock is, but I, lo I really love our team. I wanted them to stick together. Um, but obviously, when you think about it, Blue Lock is just a free-for-all. Um, we're going into this next stage now, solos. Probably not going to see everyone from our team again. Like, there'll be, obviously, there'll be uh, quite a few still, but uh, some of them aren't making it past this stage, to be honest, which is kind of sad, but it is what it is. Uh, we're introduced to, introduced to Itoshi, Itoshi Rin, I believe, this this pretty boy, who, who is potentially uh, more than likely related to Itoshi Sei, I think his name is, which is the famous footballer who plays for Spain, I think, was it Spain or Germany? Um, that we've already met in the anime, which is cool. Uh, he seems like a prevalent character, and we're going to get used to meeting him. But yeah, now we're going to be introduced to this next stage, whatever it is, probably some crazy shit, and I'm very much looking forward to it. So as always, guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. Is it only him, him in, in this room, or...? Nice control. Yeah, what is this futuristic shit? The second selection, okay. How many rooms they got if it's only freaking Isagi in here for now? Oh, so they want you to score a goal within this area within this time? You're thinking too much about this, make a shot! Damn, goalie! So this isn't just a freaking hologram. It can hit the ball. What futuristic shit is this? You've got 90 minutes to score 100 goals. That's insane. I'd be dead by like the 20th goal. That's too much kicking. And the goal moves? Oh my god. This is a crazy stage. The fact the ball doesn't just teleport to your feet. That would be too futuristic. No, he has to chase the ball too. Okay, one out of a hundred. He's already sweating on like the tenth goal or whatever that was. Level two. Oh my freaking god. Bro, this, go <laughs> this goal is sassy. This is too much for some of the people that we've seen. Define hologram because that, that hits the ball. That ain't no fucking hologram. Oh. Oh, so there's a chip in the ball that when it like interacts with the hologram, it bounces off it. All right, it is a hologram. I'm going to be honest, these two, maybe these three, I don't think they're going to make it into the next stage. I'd be very surprised. It looked like it's Isagi's going to struggle with this. 54 goals with 54 minutes left. So 55 goals with 54 minutes left. It's going to be close. Oh no, does he have to score 53 goals with 49 minutes left? Damn, okay, I get it. That's a lot of goals in 50 minutes. Oh god, max level. 
Now they're going up against like Croatia or France's goalie. This is too much. Yeah, I mean, it's, it all applies to a real game, but it, my god, it is asking for a lot in this challenge. This man always looks so tired. This is not normal. <laughs> this amount of goals and this kind of situation under this amount of pressure and how tired he is right now, right now it wouldn't... It would never come to this. I get it. This is an extreme, but like... This is so so much to ask for out of this challenge. Uh, assuming these cutouts are, uh, you know, expert defenders and this hologram goalie is an insanely good goalie comparing it to real life. Like, an expert player would only ever be, you know, expected to score maybe two, maybe three goals in a whole match. And he has to score a hundred in 90 minutes. On oh God, when one of these people actually gets to the World Cup eventually and plays with Japan, Japan's winning 100% in the un in this universe. Japan are going to win. He's going demon mode now. Okay, Sagi. I like it. He's figuring it out. He's figuring it out. He's figuring out his weapon. I wonder if Ego knows that Isagi is the main character, yep. He did it? Wow. Crazy, Isagi. I'm trying to see who from Team Z actually made it through. Okay, these two, obviously. We're going to work from the work with the boys from uh, Team V. That'd be cool. No one from Team Z, say, yeah. Bajia! Let's go! Easy peasy. I had no doubt in my mind. What if it's a team where you have to like go against each other though? Is it a good idea making it with friends in this point? This is like some Squid Game Episode 6 shit. What if they have to turn on each other? Just pick the next one that comes through the door. Yeah, exactly. No. We're waiting for our buddies. I mean, this could be a better. Obviously, if, now if Ichigo and Chikiri get here, they could be with Bachi, though. Yeah? You're going to betray your boy like that? What? Damn, is he starting to realize that Isagi might be better than Ryo? So he's not, he's not betraying his friend, he's just learning from a different perspective, I suppose. But what if it's like a 3v3 or something, and he ends up getting him out? That would suck. That's a fucking, that is a low blow. But this man, this man is different though, Isagi, you gotta admit. I just hope it's not some kind of elimination shit. That sucks for Rio. Damn, y'all just gonna steal my boyfriend like that? Crazy. <laughs> oh. Well, make sure you let him know that next time you see him. This boy has survived long in Blue Lock. He's made to be here. Exactly. It's scary that we don't know what they're actually forming up to be. Like, it could be them all against each other. It could be a 3v3 where they have to eliminate another team. Oh, are they fighting these guys? This guy is saucy. Yep, team battles, figures. I feel like he's going to be the problem of the team, though. Okay, Chigiri, you should go. Let's go. Join up with Ryo, come on. <laughs> yeah, but they kind of get it, don't they? Let's go. Join Rio. One player will get to steal a player from the opposing team to create a four-man team. Red Rover. Ah, okay, so I can see who's going to be taken from the other team and who's going to be left behind. Okay, interesting. I'm confused what would be the best option in this case. 
15? Oh, damn. 16? I'll say 7. How many players are left? How impressive is this? Every character is cool. Even like the background characters have cool designs. I don't know who they're going to go for in this case. Oh god, what's with this guy? He's worried. Rank 3. Jeez. Rank 2. So these three are the best players in blue lock right now. Am I understanding that correctly? Holy shit, dude. Where do I know his voice from? I feel like he's got a voice from Jojo. Where do I know that voice from? Jeez. Main character ass energy. Surpassing my big brother. Yeah, that's him. This guy is going to be on demon time. I don't want to fight him. He's too much. I want to leave somebody else to fight these guys. No chance. Please, no! <laughs> oh my god. This is gonna be insane. This is... Ugh, this is so much. This is like final boss shit right now. Right, so that was Blue Lock episode 12, the mid-season finale, I believe. Really good episode. Um, I'm wondering how many players are left in Blue Lock now. Obviously, if I did the maths, I could probably figure it out, but... Um, if you guys want to let me know how many players are left, that would be awesome. Um, yeah, everybody's Hanks, uh, ranks, Hanks, ranks are super high now, which is awesome. Um, I still don't know who's going to make it through from Team Z. Obviously, the the ones we we're expecting, Kunigami, Chigiri, Isagi, and Bashira, of course. Interest in this next game, how it works on whether you choose to go against someone you consider your rival or someone you consider your friend to then pluck them for your team. It's gonna be uh ooh, it's gonna be a risky one. Especially now, Isagi's on demon time, like number one, number two, and number three. Yeah, why don't we why don't we go up against them? Why not? Um but yeah, overall, very good episode. Looking forward to the second core. I don't know when that is. Early next year, hopefully. I hope. Um But yeah, anyway guys, I wanna thank you guys so much for watching along with this season. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out.